you know, she's like, do you want the banana? Yeah, like, yeah. She's, yeah. she's giving you her banana. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I was like, yeah, I do. Yeah, you want yeah, a banana? Like, yeah. It tasted so good. Oh, so the banana <laughs> tastes amazing. <laughs> Yo, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another episode of Hitting Different. Gang, gang. Gang, gang, indeed. Welcome back, everyone. Welcome back. Welcome it's good to back. be back. No you know, cap, you honestly. Know what today's episode is? Oh, what is today's episode, today's Jordan? Today's episode is, if you have not guessed it, <gasps> Halloween. Hey, yo, yo, baby. Yo, oh, baby. baby. What a good time, honestly. I will take this off. All my homies love Halloween. It was, I, you probably can't hear me properly. Oh, there we go. He's, he's back. Can. Now we're going to do a few slight few outfit slight adjustments changes. now that everyone's seen the fits. Yeah. There we are. And we're back. Nice and comfortable. Yes, sir. Back in our usual stuff. But yes, welcome guys to another episode of the Hit and Different podcast. We're back here with Lucas, the main boy. The boy's back, you know. The boy's to, back from Jono, the sidelines. Jono tried to come in, he steal my to, spot. Yeah. I slapped him up outside. That, Jono's actually... Came back in. Actually, I'm not going to say that. Yeah, no, <laughs> yeah, I don't know what you were going to yeah, say. No, no, no bad karma. No, no bad karma, yeah. honestly. Knock, knock wood, but not actually knock yeah. wood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, welcome back, guys. Um, as you can see, it is the Halloween episode. We've pimped out the set. Mate, we've done we've done pretty well. It actually looks pretty nice. Like, yeah. I don't know. You guys got to let us know. Yeah. But um, from what I can tell... Yeah. I think I think it looks pretty good. Yeah, I think it, we've done, it, we I think did we've take done us a bit of time to yeah, could, get it started. A good hour or two, at least. <laughs> at least, at least. Like the setting up wasn't too bad, but it was more so like lighting issues because the yeah. idea we was gonna have like a candle lit kind of really yeah. dim, mm, but mm. we don't have like something moody and yeah. quite uh yeah just quite mellow in a sense. Yeah. I guess you could call the lighting, but, but we do not have the cinematic. Um, cameras to yeah. like capture everything not like that and yeah. in good graphics because yeah it we're was, not built like that yeah sadly. Uh, unfortunately yeah it's all right we're, we're all right. still yeah. here yeah no we're still here still yes, gonna sorry. be a banging episode no cap um but yeah so halloween episode as you know we'll talk about last week's episode briefly still it was bit. just one thing so Jono, mate we had a little bit of a competition you and i oh no what was that a little bit of an altercation an altercation yeah. yes 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 so who had the better like Juice. So, what was the ultimate juice? Orange or apple? Orange or apple. I yep, said orange. Yep. Jono said apple. Jono said apple. We do love that. And I put it to you guys on Instagram. The people. The people mm. had to decide, bro. It's mm. li- what happens when we have these issues. We've had it before. Who had the ultimate burger? Yeah. Who honestly. had the best lineup? You know what I mean. I've been smoked a few times. You've been like a few uh, times. I'll admit, I've been smoked a few times. It's it's not nice. And I can't lie. I put it to you guys, and forty of you replied. Oh no. Big numbers there. That's crazy numbers, I can't lie. Appreciate you guys yeah, for that. Fuck, big big love, I big can't cr- lie. Yep, yep, little, little love tap. Little, little fairy claps. Yep. Um, but yeah, 24 to 18 24 in favour of orange juice. <sighs> Ooh, really? Yeah. I, you were an apple juice boy. I'm an apple, juice, apple, I'm an apple, juice, I'm an apple yeah. juice boy, I can't lie. Yeah. Like I said with chess, I'm yeah. an apple juice boy. I don't, um, I don't hate apple juice at all. I just definitely prefer orange, orange over juice the both. Over do, the do you hate orange or is it just a pref- like? What's your I thing with it? Look like a, a orange vodka is always a good treat, mm. but that's about the only time I'll drink orange yeah, juice. I'll be honest enough. with you. But um, yeah, I was I was honestly surprised how even that was. I thought orange was out by going to be out by a mile. No, bro, people people love apple juice, you know. Yeah, like apple juice is it's a good it's a good juice. I yeah, can't it lie. is. It is. It's it's so, um, different. Yeah, take that L, Jono, bro. Sit down, boy. Unlucky. It's okay, John. It happens every yeah. now and then. It's just, <laughs> you, just gotta, you just got to move on with life. <laughs> I can't lie. It. It's okay. Um, so, yeah, before we get into the podcast, guys, subscribe to the channel. Like if you are enjoying the content. Follow us on Spotify and Apple Podcasts. Give us a cheeky five stars on Apple as well. That would be appreciated. And if you could follow the socials at Hit and Different Pod on Instagram and TikTok. Yes, sir. Hit them up. Would be greatly appreciated also. Lovely, lovely appreciated. That's not a word. That's lovely. not. Lovely. It, it is not in the right context. Lovely appreciated. Yeah, honestly, I didn't use it right. <laughs> yeah, Sorry, no. that's my guy. That's my bad, guys. I'm, um, I'm having, a, having a slow day. Having a mare. Yeah, having a, having a mare. <laughs> yeah. Before we get into the actual shindig of the podcast i just want to let you youtube viewers know so if you just go to the comments down below um hopefully you guys can watch the full podcast but Mm. i know some Mm. of you don't have the time you'd rather watch certain bits you've got a few things going on yeah and you've only got 20 minutes to spare yeah yeah and they can watch certain sections so Mm. in the comment sections i have like time stamped certain comments and topics within the podcast so if you want to see a certain bit 
Just mm. go down there, click on that and view that. And I've done it for like the last three, but I don't know if you guys knew or not. So just a bit of a public announcement. Yeah, just a little bit, yeah, in that, in that essence. But mm. yeah, without further ado, bro, let's get into it. So what's been happening? How have you been? What's been happening? Well, the last week. I guess, yeah, I guess we'll go from the, the last weekend. Considering yes, sir. We had a the, yeah, messy one. We had a, we had a messy, messy weekend. Yeah. So it started off, we started the day, helped a friend moving. Um, it was really, honestly, it was just moving friends with a mate I, I'm moving friends with a mate moving yeah, houses with a mate. with a yeah. mate so it was just kind of yeah a bit of back and forth it only took us the one trip because we had I think three or four cars go I had super blessed so yeah it was it was really blessed doing that because mm. I think it was like a 20 odd minute distance between the houses so it would have been kind of a bit of a pain yeah. going back and 20 forth 20 isn't too bad where was he oh you mean yeah yeah maybe not maybe yeah. not but maybe not specific too bad from what I from 20, what I thought it would be 20 ain't too bad so it was, yeah, it was, it was pretty fun, I can't lie. Yeah. But there was a lot of furniture moving. Yeah. All that fun stuff involved. But then, yeah, afterwards, what, it, what was yeah. the game plan? So we, we came home. Yeah, what had happened, like, they'd all finished moving, like, our mate's house pretty much. Mm. And um, a mate of ours was like, yo, come to mine. We're going to go to the city. The idea was to ride bicycles mm. and um, <laughs> drink up a bit. Yeah. And just be on fuck shit kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah, of course. And of course. Um, as we're getting into the city, we've come out of the, the carriage at like Central Station, I think it was. It was, yeah, Central, yeah. And it was pissing down it rain. It was pissing down. To be, it's just for some um, uh, information, yeah. it, we looked at the time and it was not meant to start raining until 11 p.m. And it's about 8, eight o'clock at, this, yeah. p- at and this point. We said so this to, I mean, Alicia agreed on this. Mm-hmm. It's Apple weather, bro. No it's one, Apple weather. Wep- no, Apple weather's Yeah, dog. no one trusts Apple weather. If you're still using Apple weather, you're on, like, you don't care about the weather. You just look you at actually, it to laugh, you yeah. know what I mean? You just like, look at it to waste time. It's not time credible. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's you just, it's anything. That's it. It's anything. It's anything. So, yeah, it, it suggested something else, and Apple tends to do this. It suggests what's going to be the case, and it never is the it case. It just never is. It's cap. It's, so all, we, it's always like. Yeah, so we got there. It was pissing down rain. Mm-hmm. Obviously, you're not going to ride bikes. When in it was the, in the that pissing bad. rain, yeah, 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 it was, it was, it wasn't sprinkling, yeah, yeah, it was, it was, it was bucketing. bucketing. Yeah. So, um, a friend and his girlfriend came over, sort of saved us, yeah, and saved um, us so bad, I can't. She lie. had a free at hers in the city, and yeah. we were just like blessed. Said, "Yo, do you guys want to pull?" Uh, to be fair, it was literally the first time I'd ever met her. Yeah, I don't yeah, know about yeah. you. No, I hadn't met her, but before. um, it was the first, the first time a lot of the, a lot of the men had met her. Yeah, and, and it was she clutch. openly was just like, "Hey, come over, yeah, yeah, pull, pull on through." To be fair, we didn't stay there for a super long amount of time mm, like, like we, we didn't overstay ourselves yeah. i think it was like half an hour, an hour. yeah at, at, at most an hour but um we all a few of us had to get back in any ways because we had a few things to do on the on the sunday on the which sunday. we can get into briefly but yeah. um yeah no that sunday w- saturday sorry was horrendous so mm. i went in there with the game plan of like having a couple drinks just, i'll be just, sweet just chilling i think i'd brought two night. cans in with me and like i shared a, a un gay bag yeah, <laughs> yeah, with un gay, an un gay, yeah i bag. didn't want to i didn't want to but anyway, that's what he's saying for the public, by the way. Yeah, shut <laughs> up. I didn't. Anyway, so we did. Yeah. Anyway, so I thought, yeah, two cans. I've already downed one before getting onto the train. I only have one left. Surely I can pace myself and be fine. Yeah. I got mugged. You got buffaloed. Buffaloed by like buffaloed. three, four people different to drink. Yeah. It wasn't my drink. They said, "Can you hold my drink or something?" Mm. I mm. held it, trying to be a nice person. Wasn't even thinking about being buffaloed by someone else's drink. Just, yeah, and you just got slapped. And with I got it. slapped, with, got a slapped bad with a bad slap. Actually, I can picture in my mind right now exactly where we were. Like we were posted for each of them, or like yeah, honestly, no, just for the just for the one. Train? Yeah, just for the train one. Yeah, so not, uh, not that we were drinking on a train. That would be very illegal, oh, yeah, and we no. would never endorse anything no. like that. Please do not do anything like yeah. that. Thank you very much. But continue. No, so um. <laughs> Yeah, and I'm left-handed, so I never have an issue with buffalo. So, and for any of those that don't know who or what buffalo is, mm. sorry, mm. it's where you, if you have the drink in your right hand and it's open, you and someone calls the word buffalo on you, you have to just skull the rest skull of what's ever in that drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm usually left-handed. I never have this conundrum, mm. and um, I was obviously lacking that night. I think you. Well, okay. So a bit of the a, a bit of a stitch up would have been because I think you were already holding a drink. And yeah, yeah. The technical ruling is if you're double parked, which yeah. means holding two drinks. Um, if you're double parked, you don't you can't get you, touched. You can't get buffaloed because yeah. what are you meant to do? Is yeah, not walk around with a drink in your yeah. hand. So you might have got stitched then, but also Honestly, I can't even remember. Yeah, you. I think you're too far gone to yeah. even realize you're being stitched. Yeah. So yeah, so I ended up just drinking a lot of drinks. Drinking um, a few. I yeah, had had a messy night. I went to get back few. home and um, oh no, I got dropped off. I don't even know what time it was. Like one thirty maybe. It was late. Yeah. I, I was stumbling down my courtyard because I live in like a apartment building mm-hmm. and um, 
like I get to the the main door and I like pull out my keys because what I do in a night out, I don't take out my full set of keys. I take out like the keys I need to get into my house. Yeah, yeah. And then I take out like my car key, everything else, like the garage. I don't need those things. Yeah, and just leave. So I get to the front door stumbling. I was vom- I vomited at that point. I'm you, not gonna you lie. Were, you were messed up. Yeah, yeah, I was messed up. Yeah. And I reach into my pocket and I like pull out and it's my car keys. Oh, and I'm like, no. how have I done this? Oh, and I no, felt like there was no, time no. during the night and prior that I double, triple, quadruple checked. Like, like that you had your and keys. And for some reason I like never- You never, know what it would have been though? Yeah. You just would have checked your pocket, been like, oh, I've got my keys. Yeah, yeah. And Sweet, yeah, and probably, move on. So yeah, I get to my door. I'm like, oh my God, I have the wrong keys. Mm. I messaged my mate who's already dropped me off. I'm like, you need to come back. Yo, pick me up, please. Yeah, because like, I'm going to fall asleep. I'm going to die <laughs> in the streets. Yeah, like, no. I'll save my life. Uh, so he oh. ended up coming back and saving me. Yeah. And then I ended up just crashing at theirs for the night. And um, Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was that. I saw, a few, yeah, I saw a few stories of you not looking your best, I'll be honest. It was <laughs> oh, a fun time. No. It was a fun time. Yeah. But um, moving on to the Sunday yeah. of, of the weekend, yeah. we I don't know how much we can say specifically. Mm. But Jono, the man that was on just last on the weekend, last episode, yeah. Who I think he spoke about it. To be fair, filming his music video, so that was what we did on Sunday. Yeah. Um, went yeah went out had a, had a bit of a drive around yeah. Sydney, you know took a took a few really good like really good shots. Yeah, at, yeah. Um, I felt like some it lookouts and stuff. Well. Yeah. Um, not gonna give specifics because I don't Into know what it is. I don't know what exactly say. what we're allowed to say, but um. Yeah, no, like, uh, I think this is going to look really cool. And the guy that he's working with, CFA Productions, I think his yeah, name is. Yeah, he shouted my last time. Yeah, yeah. CFA. yeah. So CFA, um, he killed it. I can't lie. Like, yeah. Just from what he was trying to create and, like, the ideas that he was having, like, it just it looked like he was, like, really enjoying what he was doing. Yeah. And, like, he was actually really interested in what was actually happening. Yeah, for sure. So that's always good to see. I can't lie. But, yeah. um, yeah, I was like... It was such a. I'm not gonna lie. It was a long day. Oh, it was a long day. Like it was a. I got so sunburnt. Yeah, like it was yeah. disgusting. And plus, we were all hung. Well, a good, a good lot of yeah. us were hung over from the night before. Yeah. Up at eight a.m. to six p.m. Yeah, seven p.m. If that, it was it was dragged. I yeah, know, like we we. I was I was depleted. I came home, showered, slept. I don't even think mm. I ate. I was just that like, gone. Mm, you were just. Sad. Oh. Ryan, I don't oh, even. I was oh gonna no. get into this. I wasn't. I mean, I wasn't, but I am. But you are now. Now that we're calling yeah. him out, big Ryan. So we were Egypt. chilling in the car. I was starving for food, bro. Oh no! And we were like an hour and a half out from like oh. well, an hour. Sorry, from where we wanted to go. <laughs> oh, no. And there was like a million pie stores on the way back to like our destination. And I'm like yelling at this guy in the back seat of his car, like, "Bro, pull over and just get a pie." We we are driving past the physical store. Like we're not going out of our way. Stores, yeah. We're driving past like a million pie stores. Mm. I'm like, "Brother, just pull just over. Just stop at one. Give me stop a pie, one, please." I understand. I understand. He just wants to get back to the area and just like because we've been just out. Get home and, yeah, and yeah. finish the day. Yeah, yeah, but I was like, "Bro, I'm starving. Literally, it's on your left here. Just chuck just, a quick left. Just pull over for five minutes, if that. Yeah. Anyway, so I came to like he wasn't budging. I wasn't like." budging either i kept complaining mm. and we made an agreement with each other like if you see a lamborghini today i'll mm. pull over and you'll get a pie well a bit of context to that was on the way to the shoot yeah we had driven past what i'm assuming was a car meet or a cruise or something yeah but it was a super car meet so yeah. there were lamborghinis um ferraris all the um, everything you can think pretty of much porsches, like, porsches everything, yeah. pretty, pretty much like any supercar that you can think of Obviously not the billion dollar ones, but yeah. any any regular supercar that you can think of, they were there. Yeah. So that's kind of where the context. Of yeah, that that's came where from. it came from. Yeah. So yeah, he's like, anyway, if we see him on the way home, you can get one. Mm, mm. And like, it would have been like ten minutes out from where we need to be anyway. Yeah, it yeah. was like right before. To we be were fair, there. yeah, he said this an hour away from home. <laughs> yeah. And then like for the last literal like five ten minutes, like because we thought where we were coming from, like you'd most likely <laughs> see them before yeah. we got into the major city. But yeah, keep going, keep going. Yeah. So we pull up, and um, someone in the passenger seat yells out like, "Is that a Lamborghini?" Is that a and I like poke my <laughs> like, head hey, around because I'm behind like a passenger. I can't yeah. see in front of me. And yeah. I'm like. It's a Lambo. No way. I was like, bro, you have to it get us a pie to, right has now. To. He had to. I was like, we literally made this bet, like, yeah. and it was a serious bet. It wasn't like it a wasn't, joking. No, like, no, no, we serious. talked about it because there was a few different things thrown around, around, and there was it, yeah. a lot of yeah, there was a lot of talking. I was done. like, you have to get me a pie, and yeah. he was just like, nah, this can't be real. Like, he, to be he fair, was in denial. It was, yeah, because we were driving down like a local-ish street, yeah, and yeah, there's yeah. bright orange Lamborghinis yeah, flying down the street, and we're like, okay, like. That's a that's a casual Sunday yeah. for you. Like I guess that's what we're doing today. So yeah, I'm calling you out, Ryan. How dare you not fulfill your promise? 
It's okay, Ryan. Um, uh, we got what did we get anyways? We got JYG, didn't yeah, we? Yeah, we got JYG. JYG is a pretty. I was good happy with JYG. Yeah, it was yeah. just the, like the principle. Yeah, the principle. Yeah, of you was, didn't get your, yeah, you didn't, didn't get your pie, pie honestly. Fair. And then I forced it and I bought a pie at the server later that oh, night. It was dog disgusting. Shit. Yeah, dog <laughs> shit. Dog shit. <laughs> I was like, I had to do it because I've been like, you were craving a pie it, and, and then you had yeah. it and you're like, I'm not gonna crave a pie for another yeah. like three months. Um, but other than that, it's pretty much been a chill week from that point onwards. Yeah, been working. You've been doing a bit. Yeah, I mean, oh yeah, Wednesday night. Yeah, so. Skip like Monday, Tuesday. Yeah. Um, Wednesday night. Once again, don't have all the details I can give away. Yeah. But went on a um, like a I guess you could call it a corporate dinner. Yeah, corporate or dinner. Like a, yeah, I'd say I guess that. yeah, I guess you call it a corporate yeah. dinner. So went out with a bunch of um label executives and stuff. Yeah. And yeah, had a really like. Where do you go to eat? Um, so it's this place called Eastside Bar and Grill. Never heard of it. On, Bougie place. Uh, Bougie bad, I can't. There we lie. go. That's why. Um, and yeah, and it was like he got like this, like the the dude that invited us, obviously ordered like these like three cuts of meat. Two of them were like these wagyu cuts, Dragged and then it. another one was a flank cut, but like it was wagyu ribeye, wagyu um, brisket, which had been slow cooked for three days. That's crazy. And then like a flank of some, I don't know, I don't know cows, but yeah, yeah pretty much. A long story short, like it w- so, we had like the the head. Um, manager of the restaurant pretty much were at our table the whole time, like wow, talking to us, because just nice telling us like what the what the meats were, what the yeah. cuts were, like, He's like how, I cut this how gets for you. served. This specific like, piece of eating, I slice. I want you. I want you to know. So we order. So we order our food. Whatever. Yeah. Whatever. Whatever. Um, we get this like big fat chunk of wagyu. Yeah. We're like, yeah. Can we get a kilo and a bit of wagyu? Whatever. Kilo. Yeah. Okay, we okay, ate well. Okay, I want yeah, you to know yeah. we ate well. So um yeah he's like yeah like okay one second give me give me five minutes yeah. like, okay no worries comes out with this like big like dish type thing with this like honestly I'd have to say at least three four th- like inches thick with like wow. s- covered like the solid like so I would say at least like ten to fifteen centimeters long yeah yeah with, yeah. Like, a, a solid width on it. That's crazy. And he was like, f- he proper, brought he brought you the cow proper marble like yeah, it was proper yeah. marble. So fun fact this place feeds the cows chocolate a month before they're due to die to like increase sweet. the fat in, wow. the, in the meats and stuff. That's crazy. So they like, they blend the chocolate in with the grain yeah. and it creates this amazing like marble texture of the meat. And Oh, I actually, I haven't I, had I, anything I've, of the I'm not got, I've never had a dinner as good as that. Yeah. I've got goosebumps actually talking about it right now. Like yeah. It was the best dinner I've ever eaten. Like, so when so obviously it's all been cooked. It takes forty five minutes. Like they tell you, they're like it's gonna take a lo- it's gonna take a while to cook, yeah. but it's gonna come out perfect. Well, yeah. like, no worries. Whatever. We got nowhere yeah, to be. Yeah. So yeah. So then forty five minutes passes, an hour passes, whatever, whatever, whatever. Um, comes out with a this big like wooden tray with like all the cuts of meat like spread out. You know how like Salt Bay has them like yeah, spread out yeah, nicely. Yeah. So like that, like that. And yeah, so it comes so out. Envious. And then the guys like um the managers like oh. Just to let you guys know, um, so the fatty part of the wagyu is the best part when it's fresh, so like yeah. straight off the grill type thing. So he's like, eat, eat that, that part now. first. And so I'm with my friend Junior at the time, and he takes a big, big, big chunk of the fat. Same time, I take a big chunk of the fat because the the label executives they've they've done this before. Yeah, they're, they're, it's it's just, I say normal Friday night, regular yeah. dinner, honestly. <laughs> so yeah, so they say, they say yeah, boys go crazy on it. So pick it up, put it in my mouth. It melts like melty, salted, buttery, fatty. Just oh, I'm ah, oh, I, 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 I would marry it. I yeah. can't lie. Like I'd marry the steak if you're, I could. You're giving a good sales pitch right now. Bro, bro. It was like cr- like how much you're like would it make a dent on us if we went? Oh yeah. All right, let's leave it for like now. like. Okay, so from memory, it's over two hundred a kilo for the wagyu, yeah, that's and that's right, for right. one of the cuts. Yeah, that's right. So yeah, so it's a it's a fun one day, time. One day, one day, one day. One day. Soon, soon, yeah, soon, 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 soon. But um, yeah, no. Like long story short, I had a crazy ass dinner. Yeah, it was just it was insane. It was I great. Can't lie. Yeah. It was it was one of the best things, it, one of the best experiences of twenty twenty one. I can't lie. For like, sure. It was genuinely that, like just insane. you put me in that world from that Bro, story it was of yours. Crazy. It sounds like, genuinely. I can crazy. tell from like how you like conveying yeah. the story as well. Like it really touched oh, you that day. Bro, it really did. Yeah. I want you to know, me and my mate Junior, we went home and we were so Your hyped the really whole way home. Good. I was like, we were genuinely talking about yeah. it. We were like, bro, this is so surreal. <laughs> like, I feel like I'm in yeah. America right now. Like I'm living my dream life, like all this type of stuff. Like it was just, it was crazy. It was crazy. That's crazy. 
Oh. So yeah, that was our lives, guys. The last week, a little catch up there, as we world. usually do. Yep. Um, yep. It was a bit more because we had a busy week. But, yeah. Um, let's get into this. We've got our costumes on, as you can see. Halloween boys, the Halloween the babies, gang, the gang, the gang. Look at us go. Look at um, us go with our with our with our, with our fits. fits, of course. So I'm going to describe and say who I am. I mm. am Money Heist character. I don't know which one in particular. My mask here. If you haven't seen it, um, it just looks like a Money Heist. It just looks like a money heist. If you haven't, yeah. Yeah, if you haven't seen this, it's just like, like the, it's yeah, it's just a classic you don't mask know. from money heist. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. There's, there's nothing too For you, crazy um, special about audio it. Audio listeners, um, yeah. So pretty much wearing a red jumpsuit with a um the like mask. the classic mask from I the guess, from yeah. the show series. Yeah. So yeah, that's yeah, who I am. Not too much changed up. And, and then Luke, what are you? Moving over to me. So I have come as my. I actually I started watching this anime. Yep. During lockdown, favorite anime character, Luffy, Monkey D. Luffy. No, nice. yeah. He's, he's honestly the goat. What show know. is he from? He's from One Piece. Very nice. Still going. It's been going Still for going. like 24 years or something. Somehow. Amazing show. If if anyone's got time and is bothered to spend like four weeks catching up every single day on the videos, give it a give it a gaze. Give it, give it a watch. Yeah, honestly, it's 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 a bop. I yeah. So lie. you're you're Luf- Luffy. I'm Luffy, mate. So you got your red your red vest. My red vest looking thing. More more post like later Luffy in the mm. series because at the start he's only got a little sweater type thing, but. Yeah, I'm, I'm Luffy yeah. once he's leveled off a bit. It's and a good time. straw hat behind so him. Yeah, well. yeah, the straw hat pirates, his, his gang, his yeah. little crew. I'm part of the straw hat pirates Very today. Nice. It's a good time, I can't lie. Um, random thing I was going to say. So, yeah, I was thinking, because we have like a little Halloween thing going on this weekend for Halloween. Mm, of course, Getting of course. dressed up a bit. I'm just going to wear this. Um, yeah. Yeah, you wear that. I'm not yeah, going to lie, I've copped this for... This is going to work for three different events. Yeah. It's going to work for this. It's going to work for the Halloween party and then another birthday yeah, party yeah. that's coming up. So, it's all worked it out worked perfectly. Out great. Yeah. yeah. So um no just a random thing on costumes that I saw mm. is that um in America and Europe apparently they're just sacking off the Squid Game costumes because it it it's related to too much violence. How weird! In, I think it's only in public schools or something. I mean, like only in schools. Sorry, like in a schooling event. Type in a schooling thing. event, yeah. But like, still, bro, there's people that are coming, like people Freddy Krueger, yeah. and like, like Jason the, Voorhees yeah, or Michael yeah, Myers yeah. or any of the big horror like serial killers. Exactly, but they're like. Like Squid a, Game uh, costumes, it's racism. Yeah, <laughs> it's please, just racism. It is at yeah. that point. Like what? Like I get it's like a bit of a gruesome show. It is a gruesome show, but so is but Saw. Like, so is Saw. Yeah. yeah. Like, like, what if someone comes to Jigsaw? Like, oh, good on you, Jimmy. Yeah. Like, you look great like, bro, today. They'd clap it. They'd probably give him first yeah. place in the dress up yeah. awards. And they're like Squid Game. Can you please just not? You you bring too much violence to our world. But like the outfits aren't even violent. That's what I mean. It's literally this. It's, it's a, a jumpsuit. It's a jumpsuit it's with a, a, another form of a mask. Yeah. On. Like if and that, they're just like, no, can you like, stop no, this? Stop this. Go I was home. shocked when I saw that. I was like, that's ridiculous. That so wh- wh- where was this? It where was in America say? and Europe in schools. So there were specific regions. I just didn't remember all the regions yeah. and whatnot. But yeah. um, that's calm, that's yeah, calm. I just thought that was that was hella that's weird. That's crazy. I can't lie yeah. though. Yeah. Yeah, it's very interesting, weird. Interesting, interesting. Um, so yeah, this is a Halloween podcast. So we're going to get into a lot of Halloween topics. Yes, sir. Um, horror movies is the first one we're going to get into. Ooh. Any favorite, most memorable from yourself? So... I'd have to say favorite horror movie movies mm. in like a series would probably be the the Saw movies. Yes. Only because I like when you actually get past all the blood guts and death. Yeah. There's like a there's a really deep story that intertwines between every single all Saw movie. So yeah. like I I'm a big fan of like the the kind of plot behind the movie in that sense. Like I do it with all movies. Like I kind of like the, the law of a, yeah. of a universe in that sense. Yeah. But um, yeah, so I'd say probably the Saw movies would be my favorite. Um, what about you? What, what's, what's your favorite? I know what my favorite is. I love horror movies. Mm. Um, I'm trying to think like, what's my go-to? The only thing like I was going to mention, which is like a, a horror, my first ever horror movie I watched. Mm. So I think I was about seven years old. Oh no. Or eight years older. It's never a good start. Yeah, <laughs> I, I was fairly young. I can't yeah. remember. And yeah. I was I was with mum. I'm like, to like tonight's the night we're gonna watch a horror movie. Yeah, we're gonna do it. Yeah, so we're gonna do yeah, it. We're gonna get into it. And yeah. She's like, oh sweet, like I've got one for you. I'm like, bet. Oh, no. So she like chucks up scream. Oh. And um. Oh no. We're like chilling on the futon. It's like late at night. Yeah. Like perfect horror movie. Yeah. Yeah. Thing perfect. Too. Perfect. Like setting. it needs to be night. Yeah. yeah. Have popcorn out. Mm. And the first ten seconds of the thing. I don't know if you've seen Scream. This is the one it's where, where the popcorn's popping on the thing. Yeah. And the phone call comes in and he's like, hey, like, what's your name? Like, I can yeah. see you through the window, all that kind of shit. Oh, yeah. So it didn't even get to that moment. The the, the scene yeah. stops from the black, opens, popcorn. 
And you're Mom, like, you're like, no, nah, I don't want it. Turn it off. Oh, dang. And she was like, okay, pause down. I'm like, no, nah, let me take a break. So <laughs> let, let me take a break. Yeah, let, let me five. take a breather. Let me go get some oranges for half time. <laughs> we'll be back. We'll be back. So I, I didn't even know what I did. I maybe like watched the Wiggles. I just, you just put you something bulled, happy thought. Yeah, 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 I yeah, want like yeah. a happy thought thing on. I'm like, okay, let's, let's come back. Let's yeah. do it again. Yeah. So we sit back down. We turn it on and the popcorn's still bobbing. And it's like... And I'm like, no, no, no. Not the I was like, mom, turn it off again. Turn <laughs> it, it off, turn it off. It, yeah. And she's like, we, ha- we haven't even watched the anything. Like nothing has happened, Jordan. Nothing, You're yeah. watching popcorn pop on the screen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like, okay. Dead hat. We'll give it one more yeah. turn here. <laughs> <laughs> we'll give it one more. And then, um, uh, yeah, finally got through the popping, like half under a blanket, half like one eye looking at yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. And um, honestly... I'm that traumatized from the night. I can't even remember if I finished the movie or that's where it ended and I didn't I didn't let it go any further. But that was my first horror movie encounter. And when I watch it now, it's nothing. You I, know what I mean? But like back then, scared the shit out of me. I'd say my first horror movie would have been... Do you remember when they remade The Nightmare of Elm Streets? I did. I don't... Oh, I think it was I watched like a, It was like them. in like 2011 or yeah, something yeah, like yeah, that. Like yeah. it, was, it was like early two, like 2010 yeah, type, yeah, yeah. type of era. But um, I think that would have been one of my first memorable horror movie movies. horror movies that I watched. And I remember I couldn't sleep for like a It'll week. Freak you out. Bro, it, it scared the ever living shit out of yeah. me. Because it's that whole thing of like when you're that young at like an age and someone says like, hey, there's this demon out there who only fucks with you when you sleep. Like, yeah, you, like yeah. other than that, you're Gucci. Yeah, you're but sleep. you get in bed and sleep, you're done. Exactly, you're it's, done. It, so as, 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 as an 11, yeah. 12, however old I was, I was like, yo, not dead haps. Yeah, like, yeah. I'm not even risking it. I'm like, no, nah, he just leaves you all, all yeah, alone. He's yeah, going to come yeah, for yeah. me. Like it was it was in my brain that I was going to get done out by this guy. Yeah, so nah, like, he, he's fucked. That that whole movie series and like concept behind Freddy is... is Cracked. I remember, yeah. So what used to happen? I after like Scream, I really got into horror movies, and I love horror movies to this day, and I've watched mm. heaps. Mm. And it got to the point like I was getting sh- shit scared after all of them. Mm. I'm like, I can't keep living my life. Yeah, like this. Like, what's going on? I bro? was like, what's How does it still scare me? So one day, I think it was like I was trying to watch The Exorcism. Yeah, like the OG one. That's, oh, that, way back when. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's really messed up. Mm. And I remember like I think it was prior to me watching it. I really had to like sit down and like console myself Deeper. i'm like <laughs> jordan and i've ever since his dad i don't think i've ever been scared of like horror movies because i'm like yeah. these people they're fake they're just actors just actors it's they're literally just, just an act they get paid to do what and, they're doing and i remember so vividly i watched on youtube the behind the scenes of that of yeah of the, that, the sets the, and how the they make it work one. and yeah. how the head spins and all that and type it's of her, stuff this girl looking at lollipop while she's getting her hair done and i'm like huh yeah, it's fake. She, she's she's nothing. She's, she's nothing. She's, she's, honestly, she? you could see her on the street and say hi. And yeah, she can't say yeah, hi back. Like yeah. it's completely calm. And it was in that moment that I like really deep, like deep the fact that, that horror movies ain't bullshit, shit. It ain't that, shit. Yeah, yeah. that yeah. I never really have been scared since of horror movies. And like, it's annoyed me though because I always like have high expectations. And I think just in general now they're shitter. Every like as we get into them, like they don't beat the classics. You know, you know what you need to do. Yeah, this is for recommended for eighteen plus only viewers, yeah. by the way. But have a few drinks and it'll put you uh, kind of off edge. And because you're not, because when you're sober, obviously you're yeah. thinking about what's going to happen next yeah, and where yeah. the next thing's going. But if you're a, a few drinks in, yeah. you're a bit tipsy, you're kind of just reacting off emotion. Yeah, yeah. So you get a bit more invested oh. into it. And when you're invested into something and a job scare, like you, it scares you're, yeah, the, I, you're honestly, done out, you're done out. Oh, damn. Okay. Or maybe uh, I just drink when watching horror movies now. I mean, the weekend obviously yeah. should be a great yeah. time. I can't lie. Mm, mm, um, mm. Oh, also, 21. When to be 21 if you're in America? Because oh, I know yes. we have a couple overseas listeners. You guys Shout out to don't them. listen to us. Not 18. Wait, wait three more years. Yeah, honestly. Be legal. Um, but <laughs> I was going to say, no. <laughs> that's his little yeah. approval. Like, yeah, yeah guys. Um, <sighs> so what I have today is a little game we're going to play. Yeah. So I thought it'd be fun and interesting. So you know the game Kiss, Marry, Kill? Kiss, marry, kill. Yeah, yeah. That was, yeah, that's what it's called. Kiss, marry, kill. Like you give three yeah, people, yeah. you kiss and one, you marry, kiss one, kill. Sack but off. there's like a more expl- kiss, fuck, kill, isn't it? Yeah. Is that what it is? Or no, fuck, yeah, marry, yeah, kill. Fuck, marry, kill. That's yeah, it. yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. That's what it is. I was going to say, kiss, marry, kill sounds like primary school. Yeah, I was yeah. like, I, that was, I knew there was definitely another yeah. variation. Yeah, fuck, marry, kill. Yeah. So I've made my own Halloween twist version to it. Ooh. Um, Let me know Ooh. what you guys think of it. But yeah. it is. Three different ones here. Oh. So it's run, fight, or kill. And the basis of this, so you gotta like think from the top down. So we, what's gonna happen is we're gonna draw out three names out of this cup here. Yep. Um, they're different horror character movies. Horror character movies? Horror, horror, horror movie, movie characters. characters. Yep. yep. Killed it. And um, 
yeah, we're going to like assign who we're going to run from, who we would rather fight, who we'd rather kill. So the idea is like the most drag guy, you don't want to fight him. You don't, you can't run from him. <coughs> so you just ask for him to be killed. You don't kill him yourself. Like it's just a God that talks about, go yeah, away. Yeah, yeah, go away. The other one is fight. Mm-hmm. So it's like, he's not like, he's not the hardest. So yeah, I could probably take him on. Give him a little but run like, for his money. Throw a few hands. Throw you a know? few hands. Maybe you clip him with a lucky, yeah, lucky you right, you lucky. know, and maybe run away. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And then the last one is run where it's like, I, the, that shit, I don't even have to try to fight them. I could run and yeah. that's the end of story for them. You, you know just, what I mean? You just finish. So you got to choose which one. The horror movie ends when you take the left turn and yeah. just leave the house. Yeah, you 100%. Just don't worry about it anymore. So I don't even know if that's like the best principle to like run it, but I'm just going to give it a go here. I'm just going to run with it, honestly. So Luke, you draw first. Well. Pull out three I'll be drawing names. three. Yeah. Okay. So first name, here we go. First name, oh, we'll read it out, honestly, yep. as we go. Oh, Pennywise from It. Okay. That's a... Okay, Pennywise, that's the first okay, one. Okay, so we've got Pennywise from It. Honestly, that is anything, I can't lie. Um, oh, jeez, Louise. Second one here is coming Second up. Second one, Ghostface from Scream. So that's a dude with the mask in the yeah, night. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. I've, I've I think some, I already know. I've got yeah, some questions yeah. about this, I can't okay, lie. Okay. I'll, I'll be interested to see what, what I get for my and third final one. Final one here. So, you no, you'll do this to me. Oh, so. darn it, I can't <laughs> lie. I've got the Xenomorph from Alien. Oh, okay. Oh, Mish. <laughs> this is fucked. Okay, so. Oh, Mish. Okay, so yeah. So explain oh. to me what I what what I have to do now with my. Nah, so this is me. So you've like sort of drawn them for me. Then oh, you give drawn yours. them from me. Yeah, you oh, drawn them for me. Oh, okay. And then okay, you have okay. your turn. But like. Okay, yeah, I get you. I get you. I get okay. you. Okay. So the three options we've got here as it, Pennywise. What else do we have? And the alien from like the Xenomorph. From Xenomorph alien. from Alien. Yeah. yeah. And um, Ghostface from Scream. Yeah. Okay, I think I would run away from Scream. Ghostface. Are you dumb? Oh, okay. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Yeah. Never mind, never mind. I remember the rules. Okay. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. Sorry. 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 Keep going. Keep going. Yeah. Yeah. Run because I don't know if you've seen some of the movies. Yeah. He's There's stupid. some areas where you can he's completely get away from him, but the characters the open like the main door or go back. Yeah. Like, oh my god. I love my, my five keys. Cents. Yeah. <laughs> run. It's like bro. No. My favorite leave. high yeah. school pen. A- yeah. Idiots. Yeah. But so yeah, keep going. I'd run from him, mm-hmm. and then obviously, so it's like either one gets completely binned and the other one I have to fight. There's no way. So the idea with fight, you can just use anything in your vicinity that you yeah. think is normal. So no guns, because you're never going to have a gun around you. Not in Australia, yeah, at least not in anyways. Australia, yeah. So like you can have a metal pipe, like knife, whatever you think some s- normal crowbar, to have. Something yeah, like yeah, that, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's what you get to fight with. So it's not just bare knuckle, because mm-hmm. that would be completely that would be un- dead house, yeah. yep. I think Xenomorph is going to have to go, bruv. He's going to die. Bro, he dies. Yeah. No, uh, uh, I, I don't think I can question that, because what am I meant to do against an alien, bro? I mean... And not like, to not to get into the lore of it specifically. I know it is an alien. Yeah, I was gonna say know, Pennywise yeah. is an alien. I know. So, but, but like the thing with it, he transforms into your biggest fears, right? Yeah, that's the idea with him. You got no fears, yeah? He's gonna disappear, yeah? Well, the only fear I have—it's a bit deep. <laughs> oh no! Is is death? So what's he meant to be? I think because other than that, I might have some small fears, but that's like my biggest fear. I mean, what's he meant to be? Just to. The Reaper? I think, Reaper. no, but I think he attaches to like your most feared Memory. animate object or something like yeah, that. Yeah. Like it something that he can yeah, actually yeah, turn into. Thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't know what he Because it'd be like, oh, I'm so Biders. scared of like starving or something. Like what's he going oh, yeah. to turn into an appetite? Like, oh, I thought you were going to say something. <laughs> Gucci, uh, no, 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 no. <laughs> you going to say something. Gucci, we're Gucci, we're Gucci, um, we're Gucci. Yeah, no. So like, okay, let's say, that's why I wrote Pennywise oh, though. Let's I just realized. Oh yeah. my days. Okay, we're moving, we're moving. Pennywise. Let's, that's why I wrote him down, because let's just say it's a clown. Yeah. Yeah, I'd rather fight the clown than fight the alien, bro. Well, in the movies, they beat the fuck out of him. Yeah. So, <laughs> like, all you got to do is just not be scared, and exactly. apparently he's useless. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. I honestly, I, I appreciate what you said, and I think that's a good call, yeah. I can't lie. So, just to confirm mine, I'm going to do Ghostface running from... I'm going to punch on or crowbar Pennywise, mm. and I'm just going to have God sort out Xenomorph and his alien... The only, way. It's yeah. the only way. Yeah, or dude. call up the predators. Be like, hey, yo, yeah. come, hey, can you come hey, help, yo, please? Come hunting, bro. We, we got something for you. Are you the same on that one? Um, yeah, because yeah, I was gonna get into the whole like the scream dude's just retarded. Yeah, I can't lie. like he's, he's he's an instant like not worry about. No, but then I don't know. I can't be honest. I'll, I mean, I'll be honest. It's been a while since I've seen an alien movie. Yeah, so I, I don't, haven't seen one in ages. I either. don't know how effective a xenomorph is, but. They're literally aliens, so I'm going to just <laughs> sack that. So, yeah, honestly, I agree with you completely, yeah, I'll be if, honest. If you haven't seen Alien, 
the movie, mm. I don't think you even have to watch it to understand it's an alien. Yeah. It's, it's, a, an a, it's a dude. It's that a thing that is meant to be like 10 times smarter than us. Like it's just, it's meant to be on another level. If it's gotten to our planet. Yeah. And we can't get to its planet. It's obviously more yeah. advanced. Yeah. Okay. So the next one here for you, mate. Oh, my three. Let's go. We got Chucky. Oh, okay. Okay. I, I, I can fuck with that. We have Jason. Jason. Voorhees. Voorhees, mate. Friday the 13th. Exactly. Okay. And the okay. final one here is Hannibal Lecter. Hannibal Lecter. So you've got Chucky, Hannibal Lecter, and Jason Voorhees. Can I throw hands with all of them? <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, look, realistically, I'd yeah. say it'd have to be like a... Oh, I don't even know. So, Who are you running from? Who am I running from? I mean, Chucky's a literal fucking doll, so the I thing guess with I could Chucky do, though. Yeah, he does have um, the strength of an adult, but yeah. the thing is, he can't. Yeah, he can't. He's move. a doll. Yeah, he's like, a doll. So like, you just, yeah, you just run. Just hit him with a bat or something. Yeah, but you'd run. Yeah, I, yeah, no. So I'd, I'd probably run from Chucky. You know, you can. Yeah, definitely kill Jason. Just because man's drowned in a lake and still survives. Yeah, somehow. well, the, so the whole God's got to deal with that. Yeah, God's, yeah, it's yeah. God's, that's God's issue at that point. <laughs> yeah. I don't even think God wants to deal with that. Yeah. I think it'll just send him straight to hell. Um, and then, yeah, then Hannibal Lecter. Uh, you know what, though? I think Hannibal Lecter would just, would, it would honestly fuck me off. I can't lie. Because, like, I throw a fist, he just bite it and just done out. Like, what are you going to do? Punch me with that hand? Yeah, don't yeah. have it anymore. Yeah. Home. Like, well, gone. The thing with him, I haven't watched the movie. It's, um, what's it called? Silence of the Lambs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, I read into it, though, that, yeah, he's not just, but he's a psychiatrist, mm. but he, like, plays mind games with his, like, victims. Yeah, to, like, he long games it in yeah, that sense. Like, yeah. he doesn't he doesn't go and go on a murder yeah. spree. Like, he'll wait it out and, and he's pick not the like right timing and play yeah. it all perfectly. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. He's not the type to do, like, grab you and just... So, I feel like just you can easily fight out. him, you know what I mean? It's actually a chance you can actually win against this guy. You yeah, know what I mean? honestly, yeah, you're right. So you're I, right, you're I would right. go the same kind of thing. But the fucked up story with him, mm. the Hannibal Lecter guy, yeah. which I read as well, is that um the idea with him is that like he wasn't a, the nicest person apparently, regardless. I mean. But he, he loved one person, which was his sister. Yeah, I think he was a Jew, if I'm correct. Oh, okay. And he, his family got killed by Nazis. Oh. And what had happened? Wait, so it's based on a real story. I hope not, but like oh, the story oh, line oh, in the it, oh in the story. Oh, I thought you were. I thought you were like it was based on a real story and it was all I hope true. Not. I was like, oh, that's well, mad. The story is because the next part's a bit deep. Yeah, yeah, weird. Yeah. Is that um they killed his sister who he most loved, but they made her eat her in a soup, like in a stew. They made him eat, eat her. her body parts in a stew, and that's why he's like Hannibal Lecter because he wants to eat all his enemies now, like because he had to go through that pain and that's it's like eating madness. her. Yeah. So how, how much is that? That's yeah, he dragged. ate his sister. Threw his sister up, I can't remember. Yeah. I'm just chucking those back in there. Yeah, we'll get rid of them. And then yeah, do one more lot. So we have one more lot here. One more lot. Let's see what we got. Who we would run, punch, and kill or fight. So first option. First option. Mike Myers. Michael Myers. Big, oh, big M. No. MM. Mike Myers. Yeah. We, we do love that. Uh, number numero dos. Is Freddy Krueger, mate. Big Freddy Krueger. Friday the 13th. <laughs> okay. My guy. Yeah, honestly, yeah. The, the options are looking slim. Pazuzu. The Exorcist. Wait. Oh, the lady from The Exorcist. Oh, That's okay. her name, Pazuzu. Pazuzu, The Exorcist. Ah, fair enough, fair um, enough, fair enough. Okay. What are you running with, man? I'm definitely running away from Pazuzu. Really? Be well, what? look at the other two options, bro. What's the exorcist going to do? She's just like, she's herself is just fucked. She can get a bit violent. Okay, but wasn't Michael Myers a regular old human? But he knew how to hunt you down and get you, bro. No, I think he just was really good at walking at a constant speed at you. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I'd be, I'd never, I didn't watch the most recent f uh, f Halloween movie mm. either that he was in. Yeah, I didn't either. Because I heard it was dog shit. Yeah, and yeah. And I heard that there were so many reasons <laughs> why it was dog it was shit. Wrong, it was yeah. because it was, he just wasn't a scary killer. Yeah, yeah. So I feel like it'd be pretty easy to run from this guy. He's got to move at a faster pace than he does, and you'll always outrun him. Yeah, I guess. If that if <laughs> that know. is a just behind him, <laughs> then you've made a very just, fair if point. If he just yeah, walks he at right. a constant, yeah. fast, pa like, fast pace walk. Because the idea behind, like, the run idea is that they'll never get you kind of thing. Mm -mm. You can just stay out of like their reach Chucky, the whole time. We're never gonna, Chucky's never, that's why he was yeah. a run. Mm. This makes sense. If he can't run, if that's his issue, then then obviously, yeah. <laughs> it's the issue. He's got but like, knees. no, why would I want to fight the exorcist? Actually, no, why would I want to fight... Yeah. Michael that close. Yeah. Or Freddy. Realistically. Like, well, no, okay, well, Freddy's yeah, going to die. Freddy's, Freddy's getting sacked anyway. <laughs> Freddy's, so Freddy's out of here. Freddy's straight into the Fred, Yeah, Freddy's out of here. 
So you got yourself Michael Myers and Pazuzu. Yeah. Okay. The devil bitch. Yeah, the devil bitch. I think yeah, I'm I'm running from Michael based on the fact that he can't run. <laughs> and like, what's the odds of the devil bitch just doesn't jump out of like the devil doesn't jump out of the woman? Well, now let's say like she is. Let's say you. she is devil mode. Oh, okay, full. she's full devil she's mode. Full she's full devil mode. Devil, <laughs> devil mode. She's devastated, bro. But um, yeah, I think I'd kill her. Bad. Oh, honestly. Well, punch. Sorry, I'd have a swack on with you'd her. Have, you'd have a swack with yeah. Zuzu. Honestly, I, I could see that going. On the same well. vibe there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Well, yeah, that was that. That was that. Just a little thing to get into horror movies, I horror know. characters. Yeah, it's a bit of a bit of on the on the topic of Halloween. Yeah, you know? just have a bit Maybe of fun. Maybe you guys with it. had your. Own, I'm hoping you guys ha- made your own decisions as well, and mm. you like mm. have, have got a few into that as well. About it, yeah, but um, yeah. Anyway, so thought we'd try that out. Mm-hmm. Um, into Halloween as well. NFTs. NFTs. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of NFTs. Yeah. So I'm. I have no. Very little, if yeah. if not anything about it, I'll be honest. So yeah. um, give us a rundown, man. Yeah, what, so what are they? I won't keep people too long because people probably don't enjoy the conversation NFT, NFTs. Mm-hmm. Um, it just stands for non-fungible token. Mm-hmm. It is this item that doesn't exist. It's non-fungible, so it's like it's it's not it's not tangible. Not tangible. You yeah. can't pick it up, touch yeah. it. Yeah, and it's meant yep. to be a unique item that is like owned on blockchain technology, which is just crypto shit. Yep. Okay, yep. no one needs to go into the technicalities yep. of that. Mm-hmm. Anyway, they're doing a whole bunch of Halloween NFTs at the moment. I got myself one. It looks pretty cool. It, uh, yeah, you showed me earlier. I was going to pull it up, really but cool. we're having some like lighting issues, so I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to mess around with it. But um, they did one for like the Texas Chainsaw Massacre Leatherface. Oh. Um, do you know which one that is? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, and um, it actually isn't too bad because the way they usually do it with these kind of like big things, like Mike Tyson's done it before, yeah. is where you own them, which I think is pretty cool. Mm. It's like you get, like if you own one of like eight, however many there yeah. are, you get yeah. to meet Mike Tyson, you get to go to his fights for free one every year for oh. like free. Like you get all these cool benefits. Yeah, all these bonuses it. and stuff. Yeah, from because owning. you own the NFT. Yeah. And people can be like, oh, I can just get the JPEG off like yeah. Google Images. It's like, it's no, not how it works. it's not how it works. Yeah. I'm not going to go into that either, but no it's not how it, it works. But yeah, it's, it, it's not it's as not simple not as screenshotting and chucking it, yeah. chucking it on your own profile. Yeah, like yeah. It doesn't work like that. So there is a way to validify, validate whether yeah. it's yours or not. But I just thought it was cool. Yeah, they've done a whole bunch recently. Mm-hmm. And yeah, on that news, sorry, yeah. is that Mark Zuckerberg, the man, the myth, the legend that Facebook. owns Facebook, have you heard? Facebook robot. Uh, no, what's he done? So he bought it, a bought Ape Yacht Club, which is another NFT. Oh, wait, he bought... He b- sorry, he bought one, oh, not God. the whole thing. Oh, I was going to say, yeah, that would f- dragged. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and he's going into this thing, and he's just announced that Facebook is now being called Meta. They are rebranding the company Facebook to Meta. Me- Meta. How weird is that? So the reason he's done that is because he wants to. Has, he has this idea in his head that he wants to run a metaverse in Facebook. And instead of like calling it Facebook and running a metaverse, he's just changed it to Meta. And it has an official, like if you go to your app right now, yeah, it's, not gonna, it's gonna say Facebook. Yeah. I think it's like a long-term branding thing it's you're trying to do. definitely, yeah, long in the future. And his idea is that we do social media, gaming, work, and all this in a virtual environment on Meta, which is Facebook. And he wants to everything yeah. to like become, he wants Facebook to become this Meta to world. To become the world that yeah. everyone lives in without yeah. actually living in. What do you think of that? <laughs> I'll, yeah. I'll be honest it's uh, like it's good for people that don't have a lot going on in mm. their lives and are happy to sit down and on a screen for 12 to 15 to 20 hours a day but living in it yeah yeah but i don't know man like well, that that was already an issue obviously one of the main issues anyone would go straight to thinking and mm. apparently his way around it is it's like you know we sports we have nunchucks and stuff mm. like that and vr mm. Mm. he yeah. said he's going to make that kind of experience and that's where the metaverse is trying to go in general but he's like saying oh guys don't worry about this like I we're going to do that yeah. yeah yeah and he's like at home, you can have ellipticals, which are like the bicycles that are stationary. Yeah, yeah. And you do exercise, but you have this, mu- like you see everything in the world. So it looks like, like you're next to me, but yeah. I'm just pedaling on my own bike in my own room kind of thing. Yeah. That's like the idea he has of creating it. Like it's that deep where you're actually moving on the spot and doing weird things. But it's like, why not just go and have that yeah, social why, interaction? Yeah, why not just meet up at the park? Yeah. And have a bike ride? Like yeah. It's, not, it's not that deep. It's really not. And it's like, Maybe it's cool if you had like a long lost cousin in fucking Afghanistan. <laughs> Some, yeah, yeah, somewhere out in yeah, Wupp, 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 that yeah. you're never gonna see. And yeah. it's like, oh, like, and you actually get to see them in this and world like and meet them. Like, and it seems they like they talk you know to them I mean? and all that type of stuff. Yeah, but it's like imagine like. What you go out for a coffee date? You're all at home in your own kitchens, but it looks like you're out in some cap cafe. Yeah, just what like, like what's going what? on? It's, yeah, honestly, it's, it's so mish. It's very much full of 
very I feel like it's a very future idea. Yeah, yeah. I feel yeah, like yeah. he might have fucked up by mentioning it this early. Well, it's not it's not applicable. No. I don't think you could get anyone involved in it. No, nah, no. Nah. And the thing that I've said, so I, why I mentioned NFTs is because NFTs usually exa- exist within um, Metaver- metaverses yeah. and meta worlds. Mm. Because the whole idea of an NFT, whilst there are the image ones some of you might have seen from like mainstream media, there's some that are made for like strictly utility. Off of games. Off of games and stuff. So the reason why NFTs are going to work and like, hey, have your own opinion, that's fine. They're not. Like it's just, they're going to work. It's because the whole idea of what they're trying to do is make them with heaps of utility and in game. So like whilst you might, might not be in metaverses with like a, a Gucci NFT bag, mm, mm. there's going to be games like Fortnite, COD, where you so buy skins and guys, because that's the easiest crossover, because there's already people 100%. buying those skins right people now. People will happily spend money on games. Yeah, I do. Most FIFA, every, COD, yeah. everyone, yeah. like, most people that play games, you will spend happily money. spend more money on the game. Exactly. Yeah. And now with the idea of an NFT, now that you can own the actual object you buy rather mm. than it just, it's within and the it's console one in the of game. One unique as yeah, well. You, like that's a whole that. different thing. And you can resell that. There's like a value to that now mm. that's outside of the game. Do you know what's kind of interesting? Yeah. The World of Warcraft, uh, World of Warcraft, sorry, had a kind of a similar thing, I think, nah. from what I know. Wasn't it um like CSGO or something like that? We they used to open crates in the crates. So, so yeah, CSGO, you could open... It was just like loot boxes and stuff. Yeah, like yeah. It, oh, wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't one else? of ones. Okay. But I'm pretty sure on World of Warcraft... Correct me if I'm wrong. Yeah. I'm, I'm, there's a high chance that I am. Yeah. Um, But they used to have like really low chance drop rates on like a lot of things. So yeah, it, there right. was only ever like five or six. Obviously, yeah. it's not Give me one, one of one. We keep talking. Okay. Yeah, yeah, of course, yeah. of course. Um, Yeah, so... Obviously, they like have five or six or uh, yeah. just a small amount, but um, they would then be able to go out and sell that on like eBay or something similar, and it would then like be like, hey, who wants to buy this sort of for whatever it Jesus is, Jesus yeah. or whatever it is, for a hundred bucks, and ten people would bid on it, put it up to a grand type thing. Yeah. So it's kind of a similar theory in the sense of like selling in game, yeah. like loot for. 100%. Real life so real money. Life money. The only difference is with like NFTs is there's more versatility to it. Like mm. you can go from metaverse to metaverse. Mm. The currency and take it with is, you, yeah, yeah, you can take it to different scenarios. Mm. But yeah, I just thought it was weird. Sorry if I'm a bit loud right now. Okay. Is that, um, yeah, Mark Zuckerberg was really going for it. And he said, let's change Facebook's name. Let's Someone's make it gonna a do metaverse. It. Yeah. Someone's got to do it eventually. So, yeah, that'll be interesting to see how that turns out over the, the next cap, decades, I guess. It, yeah, it won't be yeah, years. Yeah, I think, yeah, we're looking at minimum decade. Yeah. Whoa. I don't know. Yeah, Who anyways, knows? Yeah. yeah. Um, also, some random shit, because we do do this. We talk about shit that's popping as well, so I'll get into a bit of things. Yes, sir. They're doing, or not they're doing, today, actually, a Buzz Lightyear trailer came out. Oh. Why? That's all I him. have to say. They fucked him, I can't lie. I didn't even need to watch the trailer to go, why? Because, like... I've already seen the memes. I, can't, I didn't even watch the trailer. Yeah, I just saw the memes. What do you think? Silly? Idiots. Yeah, like there's no need. For what? Exactly. I watched the trailer. It's like a minute teaser. I think that's what they said. Yeah. Um, yeah. They, they. It's a toy. You know what they did? I don't know if you know. They, they made. Him, they made him like a sto- no, but like they made a story behind Buzz Lightyear, like who the guy was. So I'm assuming they're gonna say to link it all up. This was once a character, or like this is like a Buzz. What's his name? Armstrong? Buzz... Buzz Aldrin. Buzz Aldrin. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He's like yeah. a Buzz Aldrin IRL yeah. dude. Mm. He was that famous in his generation that they made him a toy. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's the whole idea I'm seeing is at Link. Because otherwise, if they just say Buzz Lightyear was a toy... thousands of toys. This is a story now yeah. of behind this character. But even the linking thing is stupid. Like, no one really Well, cared. unless it's... Well, yeah, unless they try and loop it into, like, Buzz's, like, plot in his world as a toy, if that makes sense. Like, maybe, like... Why is there no? Why is there no Woody? Know. Why is there no Woody? Honestly, if uh, yeah, honestly, even the Woody, why, Woody really should be the one, if anything. Why is there no cowboy know. story? In the, like, why don't we know about some drag cowboy that was like slain? Yeah, on God, know, back honestly. in the day. Like, why Buzz? You know what I mean? Yeah, it just seems so like out of the storyline that it, there was no need. Like, it doesn't seem like whole, it's gonna fit. Yeah, I'll be no, honest. Yeah, because it, if it's a precursor to like like everything that's happened yeah, so far, yeah. then anything that happens in the movie. He's going to survive. Yeah, yeah. Or like if he doesn't, there's well, a no, million other toys I, I out there that th- will. I read theories. The reason they made him a toy is that he went on a, a one-way space trip kind of thing and died. So oh. they remember him as this great that like conquered space 
and all that, you know what to I mean? To infinity and, and beyond. Ah, oh, okay. And that oh, was, look, that I see how they're gonna tie it in now, and it's gay. That's a theory, though. <laughs> not, not gay, sorry. I don't, don't want to offend anyone. Happy, yeah. Happy, yeah. It's happy, <laughs> bad, no cap. It's happy. Um, um, but yeah, so that that that's that that came out today. So if you guys didn't know about that, mm. Buzz Lightyear is gonna be a thing in 2022. My guy, Buzz Lightyear. Um, also, one more thing. Oh. Another boxing fight is uh, happening early next year. Yeah. Logan Paul v. Mike Tyson. Dickhead. <laughs> Both of them, bro. Like, Mayweather mm. makes sense. Like, it's a bit, like, out of reach. But yeah. it's like, he's still a fighter. Mm. He's, he's just about to finish his career. Mm. Mike Tyson's well done. He's already done an exhibition with Roy Jones. Do you remember watching yeah, that with me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dog shit fight. Yeah, it wasn't... What's going to happen here? Because well, Mike Tyson's not you, keeping up with so Logan do Paul. do you know why it's happened? What? On Logan's podcast, he um, he pretty much all said like with chess that he'd rock Mike Tyson. Oh yeah, I saw that. Which is yeah, yeah. Dumb to even say in the first yeah, place because yeah. I don't know, man. You saw like obviously the training videos are twenty seconds of yeah. like a month's worth of training montages type thing, but like I don't know, man. I think I'm I think Mike. he could rock Mike Tyson. I think he could Bec- if he just as long as he doesn't get caught. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If he if he if he just, even two he just sits around, jumps Mike around. Mike Tyson him. does doogle a week yeah, yeah, all yeah. day. Shrooms, MDT. He's, do- he's, on, he's on everything. <laughs> he's on everything. MDT. Is that was cool. No, that's mobile drug test. <laughs> you you M- mean um? You know what I'm talking about? Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Honestly, M- it's 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 not an M, right? Yeah, it's um. I'm actually gonna hate myself for this. Why can't I not think of this right now? It's that drug for anyone that if I like if no one has any idea what I'm talking about. It's that drug where you you take so hallucinogenic. Yeah, hallucinogenic it's really changes strong. your life pretty much. Yeah, something like that. People like have talked about like experiences. We'll, we'll get into that another day. Okay. Maybe. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um. But yeah, no, that's a fight that's gonna happen soon, which is just stupid. Mm, mm. Like it's just a money rod at that point. Mm. Mike Tyson isn't surviving past three rounds. If Logan doesn't like hurt him, then you know it's cap. But Mike Tyson isn't even. Sorry, a I'm really sorry. It's called DMT. DMT. Yeah, there, there we go. go. No, I, I was no, sitting here thinking right. for so long. Okay, <laughs> yeah, 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 keep going, keep going, keep that's going. Sweet. Um, but yeah, that's just gonna be a shit fight. It's. I don't know if you guys watched the um, Mike Tyson v. Uh, what was it? Um, Holyfield. No, it wasn't Holyfield. It was some other boxer, Roy Jones. Or something. I don't yeah, know. I don't know. Someone anyway, from back then. Back in the day, yeah. and they were like trying to make some history fight out of it. Shittest fight. And it, they ended it as a draw because it's an exhibition. Yeah, and, and the same no thing's going to happen now because yeah. Mike Tyson's so out of it that he can't compete professionally. And then he gets knocked out by Logan, yeah. which I don't really... Honestly, if Logan Paul knocks him out, like, you almost start asking questions because Mike Tyson is an old-ass guy now, bro. <laughs> he can't afford to be knocked down yeah, that no, much anymore. No. Like, he takes a bad punch and he could potentially <laughs> be whacked. I can't lie. <laughs> it could lie. be the end of Mike Tyson. Especially, like, yeah, like, because Logan's a young male. Yeah. Like, I wouldn't in even say prime. young anymore. I'd say definitely. Yeah, I'd say yeah. definitely in his prime really feet, uh, feet, peak physical, yeah. like, prowess in that sense. Yeah, so for sure. if he can land a clean left or right, I don't know what yeah. army prefers, but if he can land it cleanly, it might, might rock, rock him into yeah. to sleep for good. I can't yeah. lie. Free him up. Um, so yeah, that's just a little catch up on shit that's happening. Um, also, mm. we want to get into it. We can. We don't have to, but like, do you have any Halloween party stories? Not really. Um, we've had some crazy parties, but nothing. We have like, had some really good parties. Nothing's too stand out from a normal night out, except the fact that everyone was like dressed up. Was oh, you know what? The goon swing. That was the first time. Um, was um. Oh, there's one story. What's that? The 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 actually no, that's a, from a different party. My mistake. My yeah. mistake. My mistake. My it's mistake. Not? Yeah, yeah, no, it's yeah. from a different party. No. My mistake. Okay, we can leave that now. Yeah. But, um. Yeah. No, mm. I thought we were gonna touch on it, but I've I've just thought like. Yeah, maybe we'll maybe, maybe we'll save it for another. Yeah, Honestly, we really need to do like a like a parties podcast specifically. Yeah, yeah. Well, when it comes around, hopefully when it comes to I'm around for when we were at schoolies, mm. we can do something like that. Maybe well, yeah. maybe get like a. Best stories of all the parties we've yeah. been to and all that type of stuff. For sure. Yeah. Um, so without any further ado, ladies and gentlemen. It's time! Yo, for baby. the hitting different segment. Yeah, baby, let's go. So Get it cooking. This week we asked you guys what sweets, candies, chocolates, and lollies hit different. 
just a bit of a sweet tooth. Yeah, there. shout out to my sister because this is with the Halloween vibe as well. Oh, okay, yep. So it's like imagine you're like eight years old, nine years old. Mm. You're knocking, you're doing trick or treat, mm. and you're like op- knocking, knocking, knocking. Someone opens the door. You hold out your bag, and you're like. Like, what do you want yeah. in that bag? Like, what goes in you're like, oh, my God, that's exactly what I wanted in my bag tonight. Mm. So we've got some pull-ups here. Is there anything before we get into it, though, that you think just hits different, like a chocolate or lolly or sweet? What's your favourite? Before we fully get into it, I just want to say, did you actually ever go trick-or-treating? Once. Once? Yeah. Same. And yeah. it just it was an unsuccessful day because yeah. we live in Australia and Australia is just not about it. No. But let's say if we lived in an American white picket fence yeah. neighbourhood in the suburbs and... In we the could burbs. in the burbs when we could go walking around to all the houses that we wanted to. Yeah. Um, you know what? Reese's pieces. I can't lie. Like they're just too elite. Like yeah. I think every time I see a bag of them at Woolies or I, I see them somewhere, like a Reese's pieces milkshake at a restaurant or some shit. Straight. It's on done. It. Yeah. It's, it's, it's done. ordered. Yeah. I'm ordering two, three, four, maybe. Yeah. Who knows? I think I'm the same. Like the the two that I was coming in with was Kit Kat or Reese's Pieces. Mm, mm. I think Kit Kat's just a stable, really good one. Like it doesn't hit different. It's just like you really know, nice. It's, you know it's it? kind of in that category of like Tim Tam, and yeah, like Ferrero Rocher. Yeah, yeah. Like it's just, it's just those it's just those A one chocolates. Yeah, you know? Yeah. Yeah. No, you know what? I'm gonna say Tim Tam hits different. No, oh, Tim no, Tam no. hits so crazy yeah, different. I'll, 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 yeah, I'll, I'll, yeah, we've got to pay our respects there. That. Oh, of course, of course. Um. So yeah, this week we'll get into your guys' responses. A lot of responses again this week. You guys have been killing it. We love um, the, we love all of the support. The feedback, the yeah, it's, it's, it's very great. much all appreciated. Content, it makes this yeah, better, so much better. Like yeah. last week's was cracker, mm, and that mm, was because we had mm. all those replies. Yeah, it was so good. It was a good time. Um, so yeah, we'll go into the first one here, I guess, because we just mentioned it. Ryan Reese's pieces, and Ryan's my guy. Ryan's my guy. Like yeah, yeah. to to the day I die, Ryan is my guy. I will swear down on my on my life. They, yeah, my guy. We've just spoken about. It. We don't need to, mm, but yeah, mm. you, that does hit different. Okay, okay. Another one here. Bananas from Alan's Mixed Bags from Jess. Never been a fan of bananas. I love them. Oh, I love them, bro. See, this is why we're good friends because I just give you... Oh, mad. <laughs> <laughs> hey, mad, 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 mad. We're not saying that sentence. We're moving on. So, <laughs> bananas. Personally, not a fan, but you're a big fan of bananas <laughs> from what I hear. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I I am of the yeah. lolly. Um, yeah. Someone at my work recently had a bag of them, oh. and she was like, she was like, anyway, she was like, do you want the banana? Yeah, like, yeah. She's, yeah. she's giving you her banana. Yeah, yeah. Bag. and I was like, yeah, I do. Yeah, you want yeah, a banana? Like, yeah, it tasted so good. Oh, so the banana <laughs> tastes amazing. <laughs> I was anyway, I was munching through uh, the bag. Yeah, munching oh, on a banana. <laughs> yeah, keep going. Anyway, so like. They're a bit powdery, these lollies. Oh, uh, yeah. So, like, I didn't think much of it. Like, just wiped my shorts off. Oh, so you got yellow Gone stains. Gone on with my day. Yeah. And, like, it'd been 10 minutes or so. Oh, no. And someone goes, what's all that white shit on you? Oh, oh that's so out of no. context oh, as well. No, but no, anyway, no, no. Yeah, I looked down. And I'm like, oh, my God. It was like flour dusted my whole shorts. Just, and I couldn't even get them off. So, yeah. like, the rest of my shift, I was just floured just up. Flour but, yeah, up, sorry. Honestly. I'm giving that a hit in different jest. You killed that. Honestly, well played. Well played. Well played. Well played. Um, okay, mum, you've got two here. You said oh. sour worms in jelly shots and bamboozled beans. So sour worms in jelly shots, firstly, do you want to get into it? Never had it, I'll Well, be that's what I was going to say, mum. Like, come on, man. Might, might have been a, might have been a back in their day. Yeah. Type, type no, vibe. no, okay. It wasn't like that. <laughs> oh, that was, that I was just, that was I it, just meant. <laughs> but like, no, but like, do you get what I mean though? Like, I personally haven't been to any parties or anywhere where yeah. people have been like, chill, let's put sour worms in jelly shots. Well, I have. It was my party. Mum did this too. See, this is what I mean. Yeah, it's, yeah. It's a, when it's I was like eight, it was a Harry Potter one and it was oh. lit. And, um... Wait, eight? Ten. Shots. Ten. No, ten years old. No, no, no. As, no, as in jelly shots. Shots. Uh, no. Or did oh. she mean like just... No, I think she just means like it's a shot of, of jelly. Just jelly. Just jelly oh. with the sour worms because that's what, what it was. Oh, that makes so yeah. much sense. You were like, yeah, I was eight and mum was supplying the jelly shots. Yeah. And I'm like, yo, yo. bro. Yeah. Like, I wanted to be there. Um, <sighs> but yeah, it could, the only reason I don't say, like, it does is nice, but mm. it doesn't hit different. is because, mm. like, it's not something you have enough. It's not something... I guess, no, you don't need to have something enough to say it hits, it different. hits different. No, no, no. Because like, it could be once in a blue moon yeah, and it'll hit different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, like, no, it doesn't hit different for me. It's no, me. sorry, oh, mum. No. The other one was bamboozled beans. 
They're fun to eat. They were really yeah. good. Do you remember when we used to bring them to school? I was the plug, yeah. wasn't I? Yeah, 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 I yeah. remember that. I was about to bring that like story here, but yeah, you remember as well. I was going to say, because we used to get them from Woolies and stuff, didn't we? Yeah, and then they stopped selling at Woolies, and then we had to go to like some American candy store. Yeah, there was like a, it's like a candy ocean them. or some, yeah. some, some stuff like that. I don't and, even um, know what it was called. It was dragged at one point. People yeah. were like, I was happy to be the guy that had them. Yeah, but, but people like, would just come off and be yeah, like, yeah, give yo, us a jelly bean. Give us a jelly bean. Or like, I'd run out and they're like, yo, are going to get more? I'm like, bro, I'm... Like my I've got know, five bro. in like a month. Yeah, yeah. Five of these there's, packets. There's no bro. need. Like, bro. There's no deep. need. Because oh. all math class, we used, I used to piss around in math. Yeah. Like <laughs> we'd sit there flicking because the, the way it works is a little yeah. pinwheel and you flicked and yeah, yeah it tells you what it tells you what color and you gotta and hope that yeah, you, hope you, right. don't, you get like chocolate over dog shit. It doesn't hit different, mom. Oh. Sorry, but it is a good memory. They are fun memory. to eat, mm. and they are yeah, they are great. Just but because if you get a wrong one, it doesn't hit like it hits dead different in a different way. It's like dead house, right? it hits different like or yeah. vomit or something. It's no, gonna kill yourself. Yeah. Um, we got Max Schuster, first one on the podcast. Oh, so shout out to you, Max. first time on here. Appreciate it. Um, a musk stick. A I'm just gonna say stick. nah. It's that pink. They're stick. like the pink stick. Honestly, I haven't had them in years. Yeah. But as a kid, I used to fuck with them. Yeah, they're not horrible, but they, I just know for sure they're not, like, because they're nothing great either for me, so they definitely don't hit different. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll pay that, I'll pay yeah. that. Yeah, no, 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 it doesn't hit, it doesn't hit. <laughs> Sorry, Max. Sorry, Max. Yeah. Um, also, Hannah Peters here. Got watermelon lollies. Watermelon And I'm going to say no, just because I don't know what they are. Watermelon lollies. Are they lollies? like hard candy? I don't think they'd be hard, but I'm trying, I don't think, I can't think of any soft watermelon lollies. We may be butchering this, and there is a very obvious answer here, but yeah, I feel like can't think I've of it. Yeah, I can't. When you say watermelon sweets, I don't think of. I, I can't think of anything. anything. Yeah, yeah. So we'll give that a miss, Hannah. Sorry, just purely because we don't even. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I know what it it's is. It's going over my head. Maybe yeah. you're just ahead of the game. Though. Yeah. We don't know. We don't know. Um, also, we have Thomas, mate. You are off the shits, bro. You said a cheeseburger. A cheeseburger. <laughs> That's not even the sweet chocolate or lolly. What's this man eating? Oh, or is he talking about the cheeseburger lolly? Oh, like the 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 trolley lolly. Trolley lolly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know what? We're gonna give we're gonna give him the benefit yeah, of the yeah. doubt Let's and say that he is. Yeah. And I have fuck with trolley lollies. Yeah. Trolley lollies that have like they, the cheeseburgers, the hot dogs, the yeah, pizzas, like yeah. all of that type of stuff. Was, oh, what a throwback! A That's crazy. Yeah. I remember you used to be able to dismantle them. Yeah, as well, yeah. And, and like, you'd have like the individual, like you yeah, get the patty and then yeah. you'd have, like the lettuce thing and the buns and the tomato. Oh man. How crazy! If that yeah, Thomas, 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 yeah, I, I was gonna say, yeah, Thomas, what a memory you know. just brought up. I don't know if that's actually like what you were going for there, but but we're running with it yeah, regardless. With it. Honestly, um, does it hit different though? It does. I can't. I used to munch trolley lollies yeah, like you that. Did. Were you were nothing. Fiend. I was I a remember. fiend. Yeah. I was. A, I, you have to give Honestly, it a yes just to. for me. I can't yeah. lie. Big up for my guy Thomas. Yeah, I see you out here. Um, another one here. Mm. So a few more we'll get through. So Paige. Yeah, she's a. <laughs> I know this ain't what you meant, but Candy Crush, bro, it's so addicting. Candy, it's in like the, the game. game. <laughs> Paige, get out of here, bro. Paige, bro, you're in the bin. You're in the bin, Paige. Go, go away. Go. You did this last week. <laughs> <laughs> um, Tia, the goat, always in here, always yeah. has a say. Tia, come back as usual. Um, sour straps. Yes. 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 Have, yes. You, have you ever been to Costco and gotten no. like so? I actually went to Costco recently. Yeah, you were with, saying last with um, two podcasts. Yeah, ago, with with some mandem, and they didn't have them there. Ah, oh. but. I remember going to Costco years ago with my cousin and they have like this box, I don't know, for the for the visual viewers, they yeah. have a box maybe like yay big. Yeah. And it's literally filled from top to bottom with sour straps. That's and crazy. it's it's got like a lid that you just open up and you just oh, pull the straps out of. Damn. And me and my cousin both went, we both got one each and yeah. I think it lasted us for like three weeks. And all we lived, like basically, all, <laughs> we had dinner of course, so like maybe breakfast in the morning type, but basically all, we, all we had. It was during like a summer, like a school holiday, probably yeah. summer holidays yeah, most likely because I used to spend like weeks there yeah. during the holidays and stuff. But um, yeah, we like just lived off sour straws. Sour, sour straws, sour straws. Ooh. Almost, it was almost a scary time. Yeah. But there you go, Tia. Does Thank you very much, Tia. Um, it. Couple more here. Jay Roachman, man from the podcast last yeah. week. Big he goes a bueno to start the morning. Oh. I don't know why he's starting the morning with a bueno, but like a bueno. Buenos are nice. Yeah, I'm, I'm a really. They don't big hit fan different though. Really? No. Not even like. like I, I'm how often do you have bueno though? Not often. That's what I mean. And when you have a bueno, does it not just? Nah, it, there was a stage definitely in my life where it de- like it did, kinder yeah. and a bu- like the Brano chocolates themselves yeah. were crazy. But like I remember like a few months ago I had one. I'm like, wow, that didn't really like it didn't it didn't do you like yeah, that? Yeah, because I must have associated the Brano with the 
surprise and that really yeah. turned it on and then I what kept that for a bit. Yeah. When you used to have it in like a um a kinder surprise because it's the same oh, chocolate. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I get you, I get you, I get and you. And then um yeah, it just withered away with <laughs> yeah. with my childhood. Damn, honestly. Did that hit different for you though? You know what? You've got more of a sweet tooth. I I love my sweet food, yeah, I can't yeah, lie. Yeah. And I'll be honest, Bueno actually came out with this little like bag thing. It's like twelve bites, but it's yeah. little individual blocks of the Bueno mm. bar. And that hits different. Uh, maybe not the whole Bueno bar, but that little bag, yeah. the individual wrapped little Bueno blocks. Yeah. Were, uh, it hits Crazy. different. I can't okay. lie. I'm sorry. You. No, I'll give it to you. Gang. We take some, we lose some. No cap. Um, okay, Alyssa, a big caramel koala, not the bite sized one, like the big motherfucker. You know the ones where it's not oh, like, little, like yeah, the actual you have to, yeah, it takes like two chunky. or three, yeah, but yeah, 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 I yeah. love my caramel yeah. koalas. Yep. No, mm-hmm. no questions. We'll no leave questions. it at that. Yep. Alicia. She's back and she says Skittles specifically sour. I'm not gonna lie, nah. I like I like my Skittles, but they don't hit different. See, I, they make my mouth really glucky after a while. I feel they like just, they. I feel like they like when you eat too many in like the one go, it yeah. just doesn't feel. I'm not gonna lie, I was never a big Skittle. I I would never buy a packet of Skittles on my one. Like, I used to be a Skittle by fiend. myself. Yeah, it was always when I was with you or like yeah. a few other mates from yeah. school. Like I'd have Skittles because yeah. like they'd be there type thing, but it was never like a. Go out of my way to get a pack of the Yeah, to get a pack of the skitties. Soz, mate. Soz. In the bin. In the bin. Um, okay, I think it's two more here. So we have uh, Joanna. First time, thank you. Shout out Joanna. Appreciate that. Um, she goes to Wicked Fizz. Those little chewy candy things that used to sell at school canteens. I thought the Wicked Fizzes were the sherbet, sherbet. things in the powder. They so that's really thrown me off. Yeah, no, Wicked Fizz is definitely sherbet. That's like yeah. like without a like I guarantee you Wicked Fizz in is that, like, sherbet. Yeah, in the square and you get a little yeah, scoop it scoop thing, yeah. What has she said? Oh, sorry. Those little chewy candy things are used to sell at school canteens. She mean trolley lollies? Maybe. But like Sorry. Um, yeah, I guess. I don't know what you're saying. Yeah, like Wicked Fizzes, wicked, they're great. I don't think they hit different. They're great. Yeah, a sherbet was a very something that you used to like make fun of yeah. and like pretend to snort type yeah. thing. It was never like a, it was never really a go to snack. But let's assume it is a powder because uh, I, I don't. Sorry, I don't know. There might be actually another a Wicked Fizz wicked thing. Fizz I just don't thing. know about it. But yeah, let's go off sherbet. Yeah, in nah. that sense, and no. So, so yeah, so, sorry. Um, and then we have, yeah, so two more here. So we have Bella Kershaw, new one here as well. So shout oh, out to shout you. Shout out, Bella. Thank and, you very much. And Nazmi. So they both and said they're, they're, a, they're a slut for a Mars bar or a Milky Way. And a Milky Way for me, oh, not anymore. I, it's a sweet tooth. If you, we should have reported yeah. this podcast like eight years ago. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when I was like a fetus. Peak in, yeah, yeah. in school, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Because I don't, oh. I'm not going to lie, I don't eat much chocolate and lollies and shit anymore. So it was a Milky Bar and what, sorry? And a uh, Mars bar. Mars bar. <laughs> I'm sorry, it doesn't hit different. Are you saying it hits different? Mars bar? No. Out of the two Mars bar Snickers, I always go Snickers. Snickers same as always me. Always go Snickers. Same as me. And then Milky Way. Milky Way's a lit. Yeah. I have to love them. Milky Way's a lit. Honestly, yeah, let's, okay, for the sake of them, because I feel like I've said no to a lot, mm. I'm going to say yes to this, because when I would have been, I said the image, knocking on a door, you open your bag, yeah, you have your kid. kid and you what just do you want? Milky Way? It's, it's, it's it, definitely it hits different. Has. I would have been you know jumping what? Milky Way is in wrong holiday season but in christmas in the stocking when like your parents would fill up your stocking with sweets i remember when i'd pull that shit out i see milky ways i'd be like i'm gonna eat good this this summer i miss those stockings they were were great yeah Yeah. whatever happened to the (laughs) stockings man why did we grow up oh god bro (laughs) all my homies miss the stockings um and then last one here is bethany shout out to you um she said a toblerone she had some couple other ones but we've we've gone through a lot here Mm, mm. toblerone is a hit different yes oh oh Toblerone's from the airport hit different. Yeah. Yeah. That's exactly yeah. what I was going to say. Yeah. yeah. Why is that? That's so random. Because it's such an airport food to get. It is, isn't it? It, it is really. That's really throwing me off. Have, cause I, was I swear they have that. like a Toblerone stand in the airport or something. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. yeah, it's definitely um, an airport food. It is. I, yeah. Honestly, let's say it hits different. Yeah. What's wrong with it? Because I, I, I do like, I really like I really like, like my Toblerone, but it's only ever from yeah, the from airport. Yeah, from the airport. Yeah. Never. I'll never cop it anywhere yeah. else. Yeah. That's so random. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Anyway, that was that. Yeah. That yeah. thank you for all the um yeah, all the input or y- what you guys said and whatnot. Mm-hmm. Didn't hit anything funky. Well, um, that would have been fun. But yeah, that will be the end of the episode. The episode number numero seven. Seven. Yeah. Mate, we're getting, we're Almost getting pretty double deep. digits. Yeah, three Going away. Three more and we're Far there. Out, yeah. mate. That's it goes quick, doesn't it? It goes quick as hell. It feels like we just I was actually talking to people today about that actually. And um they were saying they were like, "What the hell? You like you're up to episode six? Yeah. I was like, 
yeah. How weird. They were like, it's not been in a month and a half. Yeah. And I was like, yeah, it has. Like, it, it doesn't feel like doesn't it at feel all. Doesn't feel like it at all. Not but a single it's, bit. Yeah, it's, it's absolutely yeah. crazy. Like, when yeah. you think about it. But, yeah. Anyways. Anyway, um, we hope you guys had a great Halloween. Mm-hmm. We're here in the Halloween spirit. Festivity but everywhere. Look mask, at the haps. Mask on, mask off. Just for Future. fun fact, these spiders scare the shit out of me. Yeah. I fucking hate them. But we did it for you guys, yeah. gang. Um, so, yeah, thank you for watching, listening, viewing, and subscribing. Mm-hmm. Um, engage with the content on Instagram, TikTok. Like this up if you have. Subscribe if you haven't already. Please do. Would, would appreciate every single subscribe and like that you offer us. It is loved and appreciated. We will indeed. So, yes, without any further ado, we shall wrap this up. Thank you, guys. Have a great week. Have a great day. And peace and love. Gang. Out. Ladies, guys. <laughs>